Holy crap. Look at this. Oh my goodness, look at all this. All right guys, this title is no joke. We are so far beyond the biggest m laundromat money collection that we've ever done on my YouTube channel. <laughs> I mean, there's more money here, there's money in my hands. I mean, it's not even close. We've got, I've had to put three buckets of quarters in the machine so far. This is by far our biggest money collection we've ever done at the laundromat. I am thrilled. I've got to go collect quarters right now and recycle them into the machine because we've got like five bucks left in it. I looked already and we're almost out of money. So this is important that we go collect money before we count money. So let's go and uh, cycle. But before we start, do me a big favor. If you know anybody that needs life insurance, check out Ladder Life. They're the company I get my life insurance through. Um, they're not sponsoring this video, but I just want to give them a shout out because I absolutely love their product and they are paying for like the coolest YouTube video I've ever done. So in this video, we're actually going to do a couple collections and I'm just going to combine them into one because it made the most sense. Now, for better or worse, this is going to be kind of a hodgepodge, but it kind of makes sense if you realize that I came back um, today, actually, to come and do a second quarter collections here. And we switched the equipment up. So halfway through the video, if you notice, the audio should be upgraded very significantly because for some reason, every time I pull one of these lockers of quarters out of the machine, it just absolutely destroys the really nice studio expensive microphone on my camera. So I went out and I got an even nicer microphone that uh, I actually put on me and it will make hopefully the quarter sound so much better because if there's anything that I've always wanted to share with people on YouTube is just how awesome the sound of quarters are generally speaking clinking together. It's an absolutely amazing sound and I never get tired of it. We've been doing these videos for over two years now and every time I drop quarters in, I get excited. And I'm also very excited about the uh, money counter, um, the bill counter and everything. And make sure you uh, watch the whole video because we'll talk about the fact that I'm going to be giving my coin counter away with your very own bag of laundromat money to count as you so desire. It's not going great, but we should have enough money to clean, to fill up the hopper again. Ah, finally, finally. So like always, we take the washer dryer money, we put it back here. And in this video, 100% of the drink machine money is going to support Mr. Beast's Team C's. And make sure you watch for the Easter egg at the end of the video, it's kinda, kinda hilarious. Anyway, we open up the bill exchanger first. It was okay-ish for this first uh, several day collection. And then we get the quarters, nickels and dimes in here. They weren't super great to talk about. We're going to actually skip the Pepsi machine, but then we're gonna come back in the second collection video and um, go and get the bills and the, the coins out of the blue Pepsi machine. So we're gonna take these bills back and we're gonna do a differentiated count so we can see how much goes towards Mr. Beast's Team C's because once again, for the entire month of November, that's what we're doing. And this bucket is full of bills and it's all from the laundromat. It is absolutely, truly incredible how much money the laundromat made this month. And I don't have to like fake it or anything. I want to say there's 18 inches or so worth of bills that are just stacked up here and it takes forever to count it. But we are going to start, I do believe, with the bill count solely for there. It's like magic for the vending machine. Yeah, just uh, just the 20 minutes just passed by. So we are running through um, the bill counter. There was 41 already in there. The camera didn't go off correctly. So um, this is all laundromat money, washer dryer money alone, no vending. And that is, we're still just doing one dollar bills. It's incredible. Be sure to like the video because this is the farthest we've got without a uh, dollar bill jam. Oh crap. And if you would uh, click on the notifications, it'd be great. Oh, oh, look what I found, guys. Oh my gosh. I was going to get so many comments from those. 
This is even better than I thought. Okay, let's go. Let's see. Six one four. Wow. This is by far the most we've ever done, um, and we're only to fives yet. Now on to tens. Nice. So far it's been a flawless count. 1,499, this is close to the record and we haven't even touched the 20s, it's amazing. <laughs> if we would include, well no, if we include the Mr. Beast money, we're still a little bit short. This is insane. So I'm not sure what happened, but here's the total for the first Team Seas collection. I'll upload it later as its own YouTube short. So with almost $3,000 collected, this is by far the best collection we've ever had. Um, this is essentially one day collection, but it incorporates only 10 days of the month. If we do, we could keep this tempo for the month of November, we would be on track to do over, right around $9,000 in the laundromat. I don't know if that's because we're supporting Team C's this month or whatever, but this is this blows away all the records in spite of the crappy month that we've had last month. So make sure you like and subscribe, turn on notifications so you can keep getting updates from this as we pay our equipment debt down and things get better and better at the laundromat and I go out and buy other businesses. Be sure to check out Ladder Life because um, they're a great sponsor for our channel. They didn't sponsor this video. I'm doing the shout out for totally for free just so you guys can get good quality life insurance. Like me, I only pay 32 bucks a month. Here we are, second safe opening after five days. Yeah, there's not many quarters in here. <laughs> but there should be some money. Yes, there is. So before I leave the state, I had to come back and do another collection. Poor me, and we ended up with a lot of money. Okay, so we had to come back here between the big giant collection and do another one. And for time's sake, I figured, well, why not do it? So I'm here and uh, I upgraded the sound system. Do me a favor and let me know. Uh, we'll call this the second part of the video. Tell me what you think about the second part of the video sound, because it should be a lot better. Let me know if you can hear the delicious quarters and if they sound good. And while we're at it, check out the other actual sponsor for the channel, North One Bank. They're a business bank that I'm actually using. Um, cool, that was a lot. Um, they're actually a business bank that I've been using for a while. They've sponsored a few more business related videos for us. Um, like the first sponsor and I just wanted to give them a quick shout out. Take a look at them in the description below or get with me on Discord if you have any questions about uh, their bank. They're a virtual business bank, which means they offer lots of perks and benefits to people who use their bank you have a virtual bank you can lower your costs long story short oh crap so right, we'll get this hopefully this camera panning isn't making you too sick since I'm a cheapskate I will always pick up the quarter that gets dropped on the floor and the floors if you notice are a little dirty and that's because we've already had customers today Laundry mat gets cleaned nice every night and in the morning sometimes we uh, get dirty. Okay, now we're on the second row and we're gonna continue on. And I'm gonna give you some thoughts here about um, the financial situation of the laundromat. It's one of those odd things that people are getting mad at me because they don't post the expenses in the laundromat, which is kind of confusing because I try to talk about my expenses every video. Anyway, in our first collection that we've already shown on this YouTube video, we made about $3,000 uh, just for the month of November. And this collection will go into the total, which we'll talk about um, next month. Um, I don't even remember what we collected in October. I'll post it on the screen real quick. 
Um, I know no, October was down because I didn't get the last weekend, um, which the $3,000 was included in like part of a weekend. It's just, it just worked out weird. So October was down, but we met all of our bills. We made a little bit of money. And then November is already absolutely on fire. Absolutely doing well. $3,000 is enough to pay all my utility bills, to pay the mortgage, to pay the um, utility. It's enough to pay everything. Let's just put it that way. I'm trying to think and talk at the same time, which is a very bad idea. This did pretty good. Now on to this one. So we, in the first collection, one collection, we've paid all of our bills for the month. So this is all gravy. That's pretty good. Now I've gone through, now I've gone through and I've got all the dryer money and it's here. Not great, but it's also not terrible either. So we'll pour that in. And we got not a great second collection for the month, but it's li just literally a one weekend before I fly to Vegas. And I ended it with a uh, bicentennial quarter, which is pretty cool. So we haven't done an arcade machine collection alone in a while, so I figured I would open it up and we'll do a differentiated arcade machine count. Uh, big shout out to North One, the banking app, because they kind of paid for this, so that was cool. Here we are, second safe opening after five days. Yeah, there's not many quarters in here. <laughs> but there should be some money. Yes, there is. And this takes so much time to separate the money. The first bill um, separation took me 20 minutes. This is five minutes of sorting condensed into just a few seconds. Okay, so we have the balance here from the last count, which was just a few days ago. It was Thursday and we're now at a Tuesday as I prepare to go to Las Vegas and I've got to refresh the money. So here's just washer dryer ones like we normally do and hopefully it doesn't, uh, <laughs> hopefully we don't have a problem with feeding. Um, the company that actually makes these, Cascadia, they sent me a new uh, coin counter. So we're gonna be giving away the old one um, soon just because it's getting old and it can't put up with commercial quantities anymore. So here we go. Cool. About what, 60 bucks, 70 bucks? Now we're gonna go to fives. The new stacker in the uh, bill machines really helped out a ton with uh, sorting. Okay, 31.77. Okay, there are tens, now twenties. All right, so right about 600 bucks, which isn't too bad in five days. 120, 125 dollars, and we haven't even included vending income. Now what we're gonna do is grab this and we're gonna see how much it weighs. This is washer dryer quarters. So there's about 500 bucks in there. So we're starting to kind of run low on quarters, which isn't, isn't good because if we made 600, that means $100 walked off. Now we're going to go through real quick and count the arcade money and then we're gonna come back and do the vending money as well. Not a lot here, but I'd like to see what it is. And then this money will go right back into the coin exchanger. Power, start. Or rebound a little bit. Stopped. Cool. Cool. Sixty-seven. Um, so a little what? What twenty? A little over fifteen dollars. I'll put it on the screen. But anyway, if you want to win <laughs> my actual coin counter from the laundromat, and I'm gonna, I'll throw in a bag of free money that you can count with it on your own. Um, we'll do a link in the description if you wanna sign up for the giveaway for this machine because we've got a brand new one and it can handle the quarter volumes that I'm getting because we're just getting, the more money that I get from the laundromat, the bigger machine I got, I need. So I've got a bigger machine that we'll be doing on video soon. Okay, so we're gonna do both machines here. And once again, all of the uh, profits go to Team C's. And by profits right now, I'm just I'm just giving away 100% of the money that comes in. I'm paying for the pop, but it makes it really nice because I'm, I'm paying essentially one third of the money 
to support team seats, which is pretty cool. So we're gonna do this machine first. We'll look, it's nice and stocked. Hopefully that's a good sign. We're gonna start selling energy drinks again here soon. I have found a bang knockoff that's super cheap. I'm gonna get this, and it's pathetic. Hardly anything. Jimmy is going to be so mad. I have this feeling he's gonna punch me in the face. Maybe I won't even get to see him. All right. So hopefully the quarters are a little better. They're not. This sucks. But we had a good laundromat collection, so. Oh. Granted, I, I guess this is like a five day collection, but still it's pretty, pretty low. Much, much worse than the laundromat would have been expected. But I haven't got money out of this pop machine in a while. So we'll see about this one. Hopefully it's making the money. Okay, stocked up pretty good. Got my Gatorade in there, so that's nice. All right, check the bill acceptor. Pretty much the same system. And this is a bit better, so I'm hoping we're not uh, essentially cannibalizing things between one and the other. So we got this full of money, which is good. So surplus is in here. About the same as the other. No, this is more than the other machine, so that's cool. All right. It's still kind of crappy. So this will be for Team C's from the pop machines. Cool, we found a Susan B. Anthony dollar. So uh, we'll save that for Jimmy. That'll go on the count. So that plugged up the machine and we're restarting it. 125. So we got all those nickels and dimes, which is just an absolute ton of money. And then we added these because I got to recycle these. So we're at 243 plus the 43 there. So 43 there plus 6075 means we're donating another little over $100 to Team C's plus the last collection in the video plus what's that before. And while we're at it, we're gonna get snacks, yay. All right, we'll see. We've been restocking these with all sorts of different kinds of snacks, which is pretty cool. And this is really good in terms of snack money. And we did really good on quarters. I'm still waiting on the repair parts, but someone has screwed this up. You can see the uh, springs popping out of it. My crew should be fixing this soon. <laughs> That someone got in there tried to break it. This is like the only vandalism we've had. It's pretty cool. So these are just ones, 37 bucks. We're throwing these in the bucket again. This is pretty good. Of course, it heard me. Okay, so a little over $75 on the snack machine. So we had about a hundred dollar a week, which is pretty cool. Not too bad. Nice. It's almost full. So we had more in there than I thought, so. That's a good thing. 250, 500, 750. This is a thousand and it's almost a thousand. Good, which is good. 
So hopefully the video wasn't too disjointed, but the numbers are awesome. We made a little under 3,000 on the first collection for the month. The second collection was 556. This is only the laundromat money. Um, no quarter machine, no vending machine. Just for the drink machines in the first collection, we did 104.75. Second collection was 103.75, and my cost is one third generally of what the revenue is. The first snack machine total was 123.75. We uploaded that as a short not in the video and the second snack machine count was 11375 so if we would go through and we would take all these totals together we are just a few dollars shy of $4000 and we're halfway through the month this we are so much on track to have the best month we've ever had. And for this second Team Sheet C's contribution, we are a little over $200. I had a bunch of people complain that they didn't see my um, confirmation emails. So here they are from Team C's, showing the first donation was 220, the second donation was 209, and we're gonna keep going through this. Thanks for supporting Mr. Beast Team C's. I appreciate it. And so does the the uh, the ocean. You wanna you wanna be on the next video? Uh, sure. Okay. All right. All I need you to do is say yes. Okay. They'll be on the next one. This really nice lady is bringing a car full of laundry. That kid over there just helped clean the ocean up. <laughs> 